Have you ever stopped to think about the most powerful force in the universe? It's not gravity, not dark matter, not even love. It's something far more subtle, yet infinitely more potent. Something that can quite literally change the course of your life. I'm talking about gratitude. Now, you might be thinking, gratitude? That's nice. But is it really that powerful the answer is a resounding yes? Gratitude isn't just about feeling thankful for the good things in life. It's a key that unlocks a door to a whole new way of being. Science is now confirming what spiritual traditions have known for millennia gratitude has the power to transform us on a cellular level. It can shift our perception of reality, improve our health, and even rewrite our genetic code. Sounds unbelievable, right? Well, in this video, we're going to delve into the science behind gratitude and explore some truly mind-blowing facts. Did you know that practicing gratitude can literally shrink the amygdala, the part of your brain responsible for fear and anxiety, or that it can boost your immune system and increase your lifespan? These are just a few of the incredible benefits that come with cultivating a grateful heart. But gratitude isn't just about the physical benefits. It's about opening yourself up to a world of abundance, joy, and connection. It's about seeing the good in every situation, even the challenging ones. By the end of this video, you'll have the tools and techniques you need to unlock the transformative power of gratitude in your own life. So if you're ready to experience a shift in your life, a shift that can bring you more peace, happiness, and fulfillment, then stay tuned. In this video, we're going to crack the code of gratitude and unlock its hidden potential. But before we begin, I want to welcome you all to the World is Life channel. If you're new here, consider subscribing for more inspiring content that will help you on your journey to a more empowered and fulfilling life. Now, let's dive in. At its core, gratitude is the feeling of thankfulness and appreciation for the good things in our lives. It's a recognition that we are blessed whether by fortunate circumstances, the kindness of others, or simply the beauty of the world around us. But gratitude goes far deeper than just saying thank you. It's a conscious choice to focus on the positive, to savor the good moments, and to cultivate an attitude of appreciation for life's gifts, big and small. Think about it this way. Imagine two people sitting down to a delicious meal. One person might scarf down their food without a second thought, barely acknowledging its flavor or the effort that went into preparing it. The other person, however, might take a moment to appreciate the colors on their plate, the aroma of the food, and the company they're sharing it with. They might even offer a silent thanks for the bounty before them. The first person might be well-fed, but they're missing out on a deeper experience. Gratitude adds a layer of richness and enjoyment to life. It allows us to truly savor the good moments, big or small, and to recognize the blessings that might otherwise go unnoticed. Here's another example. Let's say you receive a beautiful bouquet of flowers. A simple thank you is a polite response, but true gratitude goes beyond that. It's taking the time to admire the arrangement of the flowers, to appreciate the vibrant colors and delicate textures, and to acknowledge the thoughtfulness of the person who sent them. It's about letting the beauty of the flowers fill you with a sense of joy and appreciation. Gratitude isn't just about acknowledging positive experiences, though. It's also about finding the good in challenging situations. Perhaps you're facing a difficult time at work. In that moment, it's easy to get bogged down by the stress and frustration. However, with a grateful mindset, you might find yourself appreciating the opportunity to learn new skills, to develop your resilience, or to discover hidden strengths within yourself. For a long time, gratitude was primarily seen as a virtue or a character trait. But in recent years, science has begun to catch up with what spiritual traditions have known for centuries. Gratitude has a profound impact on our well-being, both psychologically and physically. Studies by Robert Emmons, a leading researcher on gratitude, have shown that practicing gratitude can lead to a significant increase in happiness and life satisfaction. One study published in the Journal of Personality and Social Psychology found that participants who kept gratitude journals reported feeling happier, more optimistic, and slept better than those who didn't. These findings suggest that a simple practice of focusing on what we're grateful for can have a measurable impact on our emotional well-being. 
But the benefits of gratitude go beyond just feeling good. Research published in Psychosomatic Medicine suggests that gratitude can also have a positive impact on our physical health. This study found that participants who practiced gratitude showed a decrease in inflammatory markers, which are linked to a variety of chronic diseases. The researchers suggest that gratitude may boost the immune system and help protect us from illness. So how does gratitude work its magic? It turns out that gratitude has a powerful effect on the brain. Studies using fMRI technology have shown that practicing gratitude activates the medial prefrontal cortex, the part of the brain associated with positive emotions and reward processing. This suggests that gratitude literally rewires our brains to be more positive and optimistic. Another way gratitude benefits us is by reducing activity in the amygdala, the part of the brain responsible for fear and anxiety. By shifting our focus to the positive aspects of our lives, gratitude helps us to manage stress and cultivate a sense of calm. The science behind gratitude is still emerging, but the evidence so far is clear gratitude is a powerful tool that can improve our mental and physical health, boost our happiness, and help us live more fulfilling lives. In the next section, we'll explore some practical ways to cultivate gratitude in your own life. The connection between gratitude and spirituality is as old as human history itself. Across cultures and religions, the importance of expressing thankfulness and appreciation for the divine, for nature's bounty, and for the blessings in our lives has been a core tenet of spiritual practice. In many religions, gratitude is expressed through prayer and rituals of thanksgiving. For example, Muslims practice daily prayers that express gratitude to Allah for guidance and blessings. Similarly, Christians give thanks to God for creation, for life's gifts, and for forgiveness. These practices serve as a reminder to cultivate an attitude of gratitude in daily life. Beyond formal rituals, spiritual traditions often emphasize the importance of cultivating a sense of awe and wonder at the world around us. In a video by renowned teacher Eckhart Tolle talks about the transformative power of appreciating the simple things in life, the warmth of the sun on your skin, the taste of a fresh piece of fruit. By cultivating an awareness of these everyday miracles, we can cultivate a sense of gratitude that deepens our connection to the present moment and to the world around us. Gratitude also plays a role in fostering inner peace and acceptance. Many spiritual traditions teach that suffering arises from a sense of lack or dissatisfaction. By cultivating gratitude, we learn to appreciate what we already have, shifting our focus away from what we lack and towards the abundance that surrounds us. This shift in perspective can lead to a greater sense of inner peace and contentment. Eastern spiritual traditions like Buddhism take gratitude a step further. The concept of dana, which translates to generosity, is a cornerstone of Buddhist practice. Dana encourages the practice of giving freely, not just material possessions, but also our time, our energy, and our appreciation. By giving freely, we acknowledge the interconnectedness of all things and cultivate a sense of gratitude for the blessings that come from our connection to the world around us. Ultimately, gratitude and spirituality is not just about feeling good or expressing thanks. It's about cultivating a way of being that allows us to see the world with fresh eyes, to appreciate the beauty and wonder that surrounds us, and to connect more deeply with ourselves and with the world around us. In the next section, we'll explore some practical ways to cultivate gratitude in your daily life. The good news about gratitude is that it's not a rare or elusive feeling. It's something we can all cultivate in our daily lives, regardless of our circumstances. Here are a few simple practices to get you started. Start a gratitude journal. This is a classic technique for a reason. Dedicate a few minutes each day, either in the morning or before bed, to writing down a few things you're grateful for. It can be anything a supportive friend, a delicious meal, a beautiful sunset. The key is to be specific and to focus on the positive aspects of your life. Practice gratitude walks, take a walk in nature, and consciously focus on the things around you that you appreciate. Notice the warmth of the sun on your skin, the sound of birds chirping, the smell of fresh flowers. By engaging your senses, you can deepen your appreciation for the simple beauty of the world. The gratitude jar, this is a fun activity you can do with friends or family. 
decorate a jar and keep it somewhere you'll see it every day. Whenever you experience something you're grateful for, write it down on a piece of paper and add it to the jar. Over time, you'll have a collection of positive memories and reminders of the good things in your life. The thanks for technique throughout your day, take a moment to silently say thank you for the things you encounter. Thank the barista for making your coffee. Thank the bus driver for getting you safely to your destination. Thank your body for allowing you to move and experience the world. This simple practice can shift your focus towards the positive and cultivate an attitude of appreciation. The gratitude challenge challenge yourself to find three things you're grateful for each day, even on difficult days. This practice can help you reframe negative situations and cultivate a more optimistic outlook. The beauty of gratitude is that it's accessible to everyone. You don't need any special tools or resources to start practicing. It's simply a matter of shifting your perspective and focusing on the positive aspects of your life. Remember, gratitude isn't about ignoring challenges or pretending that everything is perfect. It's about acknowledging the good alongside the bad and finding reasons to be thankful even in the midst of difficult times. By incorporating these simple practices into your daily life, you can cultivate a sense of gratitude that will transform even the most mundane aspects of your life, leading to greater happiness, peace, and well-being. The power of gratitude isn't just theoretical. It's a force that can have a profound impact on people's lives. Here are a few stories that illustrate the transformative power of gratitude. From burnout to bliss Sarah, a high-powered lawyer, found herself on the verge of burnout. Long hours, constant pressure, and a relentless sense of dissatisfaction had taken a toll on her health and happiness. One day, she stumbled upon a book about gratitude and decided to give it a try. She started by keeping a gratitude journal, writing down three things she was grateful for each day. At first, it felt like a chore, but gradually, her perspective began to shift. She started noticing the small things, the kindness of a colleague, the beauty of a sunrise, the comfort of her own home. With time, her stress levels decreased, her sleep improved, and she found a renewed sense of purpose in her work. Gratitude became the key that unlocked a door to a more balanced and fulfilling life. Finding Hope in Adversity David, a young man diagnosed with a chronic illness, found himself consumed by anger and despair. His once active life was now filled with doctor visits and limitations. One day, his therapist suggested a gratitude practice. Initially skeptical, David decided to give it a shot. He started by focusing on the things he could still do, the love and support of his family, and the beauty of nature that he could still appreciate. Slowly, his perspective began to change. He found gratitude for the small victories, a good day with minimal pain, a delicious meal, a heartfelt conversation with a loved one. Gratitude didn't erase his challenges, but it gave him the strength to face them with more hope and resilience. Gratitude is a spiritual compass for many people. Gratitude is a cornerstone of their spiritual journey. In a recent interview, a renowned yoga teacher spoke about how cultivating gratitude has deepened her connection to the divine. By appreciating the interconnectedness of all things, she feels a sense of awe and wonder at the world around her. This gratitude fuels her compassion for others and inspires her to live a life of service. These are just a few examples of how gratitude can transform lives. By expressing thanks for the good in our lives, we open ourselves up to a world of abundance, joy, and connection. It's a practice that anyone can embrace, regardless of their background or beliefs. In the next section, we'll wrap up this exploration of gratitude by offering some concluding thoughts. In this video, we've explored the transformative power of gratitude. We've seen how gratitude goes beyond simply saying thank you. It's a conscious choice to focus on the positive aspects of life, to cultivate an attitude of appreciation, and to recognize the blessings that surround us. We've learned about the science behind gratitude, how it can improve our mental and physical well-being, and how it can literally rewire our brains for happiness. We've also explored the connection between gratitude and spirituality, how it fosters inner peace, and how it deepens our connection to the world around us. Finally, we've shared some practical ways to cultivate gratitude in your daily life from keeping a gratitude journal to practicing gratitude walks. The possibilities are endless. 
Remember, gratitude is accessible to everyone. It's a simple practice with profound benefits. So if you're looking for a way to experience more joy, peace, and fulfillment in your life, embrace gratitude. It's a powerful tool for spiritual growth and personal development. By cultivating an attitude of thankfulness, you can unlock a world of possibilities and transform your life in miraculous ways. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below how you plan to incorporate gratitude into your own life. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel, World is Life, for more inspiring content that will help you on your journey to a more empowered and fulfilling life. Thank you for watching.